Hi friends, this is me Gulzar. I am working as lecturer mathematics. Today we will be discussing about algebra and its terminology. So before proceeding to the terminology of algebra, it is worth mention here, worth to mention here that the word algebra was first of all coined by an Arab mathematician Al Khwarizmi in his book Al Jabr Wal Muqabla. So let's proceed to the first terminology or the first word used in algebra that is variable. A variable is a letter or a symbol that represents a number or an unknown quantity. For example, here we have 8 plus x is equal to 12. 8 is a number, plus is a symbol, and 12 is also a number. But here x can be any unknown number. So x here is, a example, is an example of a variable. The another definition of variable is, a variable can use any letter of the alphabet from A to Z. But generally, uh, we use uh, X, Y, Z and L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z to represent the variables. For example, here X plus 5, X is a variable. And another expression is y minus 7, here y is a variable. And in z minus 25, z is a variable. Now let's define algebraic expression. Algebraic expression is a group of numbers, symbols and variables that express an operation or a series of operations. For example, for an algebraic expression, we must have three things number one numbers number two symbols or you can say the basic mathematical operations and number three the variables for example we have 2x plus 8 this is an algebraic expression because it's a combination of numbers 2 and 8 variable x and addition that is the symbol or the operation Another example of algebraic expression is y minus 3. In this expression, y is a variable and 3 is a number. Let's uh, proceed ahead. How to simplify by combining the like terms? If we have an algebraic expression having similar terms or like terms, let's see how to combine these like terms. In this algebraic expression, we have x plus 8 plus x. We combine the x, first x with the third term that is also an x and bec it becomes x plus x that means twice x, 2x and plus 8. This is how we combine the like terms and complete all operations. Another example is 2 into 2 plus 8. Now 2 and 2 are like terms, we simplify the expression, part of the expression that lies within the braces. 2 into 2 means 4 plus 8 and the total sum comes out to be 12. Now here are some words which lead to the addition. In word problems we use these words uh, as addition. For example we have sum, sum is used as addition or we can say addition uh, is written instead of sum. One more term is more than, increased and plus. We have one more all together. And there are some words which lead to subtraction. For example, decreased, less, difference, minus, how many more. Now, let's try to see how these words lead to the addition or subtraction. For example, we have 10 more than a number. 10 more than a number. Here are two things. 10 and a number. If we represent a number with a variable, then the expression, the algebraic expression comes out to be n plus 10. Because here n is represented, representing a number and 10 is the given number. Another uh, sentence or the word phrase is a number decreased by 5. 
if we represent the number by x it is decreased by 5 so the expression will come out to be x minus 5 or y minus 5 or z minus 5 or n minus 5 here we write it w minus 5 the another word phrase is 6 less than a number 6 less than a number if we represent the number by x or by n the expression comes out to be x minus 6 the another the fourth uh, phrase phrasal word is a number increased by 8 if we represent the number by x the expression will come out to be x plus 8 or n plus 8 or z plus 8 we have another uh, word phrase that is sum of a number in 9 let's represent the number by x and 9 that becomes x plus 9 or n plus 9 4 more than a number means y plus 4 now here are some more phrases or word phrases a number s plus 2 the algebraic expression will come out to be s plus 2 a number decreased by 1 so if we represent the number by x the algebraic expression will come out to be x minus 1 or k minus 1 31 less than a number that means x minus 31 a number b increased by 7 the algebraic expression will come out to be b plus 7 the sum of a number and 6 if we represent the number by n and 6 that will become n plus 6 or x plus 6 9 more than a number means x plus 9 or z plus 9 now let's come to another uh, definition or you can say evaluate each algebraic expression when x is 10 here we are given the algebraic expression we substitute a number in space of a variable for example first expression expression we have x plus 8 if we substitute x is equal 10 the algebraic expression comes out to be 18 another is x plus 49 if we substitute x is equal 10 the result comes out to be 59 in third case x plus x it becomes 10 plus 10 means 20 10 minus 10 becomes 0 10 minus 7 becomes 3 42 minus 10 becomes 32 exactly now let's try to complete this table on the left side of the table we have n on the right column of the table we have n minus 3 now if we replace n by 5 on the left we'll have to replace it on the right as well if we replace n by 5 on the right the result comes out to be 5 minus 3 that is 2 yes exactly now if we replace n by 10 the result on the right comes out to be 10 minus 3 that is 7 and in third case it becomes 21 minus 3 that is 18 and 32 minus 3 becomes 29 let's complete another table here on the left side of the table we have x on the right side of the table we have x plus 6 if we replace x by 5 the result on the right side of the table comes out to be 5 plus 6 that is 11 and 10 plus 6 that is 16 21 plus 6 that is 27 32 plus 6 that is 38 now here are some situations we'll try to express these situations in algebraic expressions for example Scott's brother is two years younger than Scott let's try to write this situation in algebraic expression if we represent the age of Scott by s since the Scott's brother's age is two years less so the Scott's age would be Scott's brother's age would be s minus 2 okay and the situation is the sum of two numbers is 12 if we rep represent the two numbers by x and y the expression will become x plus y is equal to l or a plus b is equal to l or c plus d is equal to l or you can represent it by v and c it comes out to be v plus c is equal to l 
The third situation is the difference between two numbers is 5. If we take one number by m, one number by uh, m and another number is represented by n, then the expression comes out to be m minus n is equal to 5. So this was all about from the algebra or the basic definitions of algebra. Thank you very much for watching.